Questions for Umar. Coming off four straight double doubles. Is it, um, what's this transition been for you? Did you play very well? Energy, uh, more confident? Yeah, pretty much just energy and confidence and knowing that my teammates believe in me. When you got here three years ago, did you see this, what, what you're doing right now as a possibility? You know, my my journey has been super long, you know, but deep inside, I always knew I was capable of doing something special, whether it was Gonzaga or somewhere else. You know, I just needed the opportunity to do it. And coming here, I got the opportunity, and, and I'm, grateful, I'm grateful for it. Well, the, the first two years, um, you had Zoo next to you, and it worked out a great tandem. Now this year, you've kind of had to be the guy as far as the interior working with new people. How much has that been a transition and, and getting used to being more of a primary like that? Uh, you know, it was a challenge a little bit in the beginning of the season, you know, because Zoo was really good at throwing high lows, and it took Key some time to get used to it. You know, and right now he's like really good at it. He he knows how to read the defense. He knows how to throw it and when to not throw it. So that's making my job a little bit easier to get easy I low. And Kylan is a really good job pushing the ball, trying to look at my pointy post, which is pretty good. And now you know, it, it just uh, just have to you know finish those. Umar, what did you like just about the way the team handled the trip to Utah, and Colorado, being able to come away with two victories in two very tough places to win? You know, we knew uh, it was going to be a tough road trip for us, you know, elevation and 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 stuff like that. Uh, and also, like, we're going to a place where they never lost at home for a year, you know. So they for sure was going to be fired up to play against us. And, and we needed to handle it with maturity and know that uh, we need those games more than anything. And we approach it that way. And that's why we got the result that we wanted. Backside now of that trip, you mentioned the elevation. How did you feel? How'd your body feel? What did you experience? You know, it's hard. You know, the first couple of minutes, you know, you feel like, damn, like I'm out of shape. But <laughs> you really are in shape. It's just like a different type of environment, you know. But if you power through that first two, three minutes, then like it would become easy. Tommy said he likes where the team is at right now. What are your thoughts on where you guys are at? No, I think we 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 in a good spot, you know, for sure. We not taking anything for granted, but but we 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 trending to the right direction uh, as an individual and as a team. Do you uh, how about like just ASU in general and then them beating you here last year with Senior Day or whatever? And I mean, did that is that I'm on that crazy shot too? I mean, did that stand out? And, or you just kind of forget about that? No, it's basketball. You know, whenever we play ASU, we know how, you know, uh, those games are and how what fan, fans expect uh, from us. You know, and and you can just forget about that. You know, it's also if anything that gives us like extra motivation to play well for our fans, for the city. You know, at the end of the day, it's all love. ASU is a great program, so are we? You know, so it's just gonna be a fun, fun game Saturday. Do you remember anything like a game? I think you had foul trouble. And, uh, I remember it pretty well. What's your, yeah, what, what is your Stay thought? out of all trouble. <laughs> ASU on film, why are they so effective at getting steals? You know, they are very handsy. You know, they, they, they gamble, they go for seals, and, and they are very aggressive. And, and for us to, to play well our best, we just need to play with fundamentals and, 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 and play easy, make game simple. Notice from you, and I think also from Keyshot uh, lately, a lot of the the tap out kind of rebounds. Is that something you practice, as far as like knowing that there's going to be somebody deep on that? Yeah, you know, uh, when you go into offensive glass, sometimes you cannot go with both hands because you're boxing the guy out, or like you're trying to make move. And, and the easiest way is just tap out because most of the time you're gonna have at least two guards standing out there, and and there's a possibility, there's a high chance that. The ball gonna fall in those guys' hands, and if you gonna grab it, then just try to tap it out. And that's more on the offense than the than the defensive. Yeah, side. yeah, just on. Yeah, you have to grab the ball on the defensive side. Umar, obviously, we're in a much different era now with NIL, uh, and and I would think you know you might have the most prominent role of any athlete in this new era with the commercials that you're doing. How did that whole thing come together, and 
what's been fun about being a part of that uh, the, the, the situation with the heating and cooling company? Uh, we are just grateful. You know, we are grateful for the NCAA to making to make this possible for our generation and and. And it's, it's been a blessing to us and, and for everyone who's been part of it. And I'm nothing but grateful for, for that opportunity. Uh, I mean, did you think you could act? I mean, was that something you ever imagined? That no, coming here, I never really imagined anything like that. You know, but it's crazy because things change every day, you know. And, and for us to, for them to allow us to do stuff like that is, is amazing. How would you grade yourself as an actor? Uh, no, no, not that high, because those jobs are hard, honestly. Acting is really super hard, but, but it's fun, it's fun. How many takes do you, has it, does it take you to get uh, the lines right? Yes, yes, it does, especially when, you know, you have to pronounce everything the right way and accent and, and you know, it's kind of a little bit, it's a lot, lot of work than people might think. It takes longer. Boom, are you, uh, you guys have been embodying the spirit of this program and you've talked about it all season long. Going into rivalry week like this, how much do you kind of embody the spirit of the fans and know that they're going to be maybe giving you a little more juice on Saturday night? You know, whenever we play home, uh, I don't take those games for granted, you know, because we don't, we don't have many of them a year. And, and for us to come out play ASU Saturday, I know our fans are ready. They wish we could play today, you know, so... For us, we just you know gotta come out and put put on a show for them because they deserve every single bit of it, and 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 we need to be our best on Saturday because we know for sure they're gonna be at their best. Is there a particular message about the significance of the rivalry that you or some of the other veterans have given some of the other players in the team that haven't played in this game before? You know, uh, I think like growing up, we all had uh, you know rivalry games, whether it's a school or like countries, you know, and. And for games like that, it's, it's, it's fun, first of all. And secondly, it's even sweeter to win games like that. You know? So I think our guys are, are locked in, and, and, and we'll be waiting for that game because it's going to be a fun, fun night on Saturday. Umar, how much, of the, or if anything, uh, of the way you played lately has to do with just the time of year? It's getting to be a stretch run. You, know, you want to finish on a roll, that kind of stuff. Is that, it had, has it, is that added anything to what you're talking about aggression-wise? I mean, I believe you all asked me this question, and, and he answered that he said it's time. So I guess it's time, you know, to, to be aggressive. Yeah. And I didn't know, in your case, too, if you consider that, like, you know, you're a senior, but there's always that COVID year. Do you look at this like this is it, or do you know even what you think? Bros, I don't know. I'm just trying to play a game every day, come out, have fun with my teammate, my future. I have no idea what's going to happen, you know, because this is the year I'm in, so I gotta focus on this year and, and enjoy the time with my teammates. All right. Anything else? Yeah. Good to go. Thanks. Come on, Jason. No question for me?